right down in there. I'll hold on to her. Yes, Ella May. Yes, Ella May. Yes, Ella May. They're trimming their hooves. Let's grow faster than they can wear them off. So. If they were out in the wild, they probably wouldn't get this. The idea is to make the uh, hooves Smooth, so there are no uh, places for the mud and manure to collect and cause hoof rot. He's not really aggressive. He's just guarded. We're putting coats on them to keep their fleece from getting hay and dirt spread out all over the fleece. And so this the fleeces are going to be covered with these coats until they get shorn in April. I don't know if you'll let, let me. Yes, Gannon. Oh, that's nice. That's oh, beautiful. Hey, you got to yeah. Gannon. Okay, Tinka. You can do a little bit on your feet. So anyway, this chair has really helped us a lot. It's helped our backs, our arms. Okay. Well, yeah, I think you tip it off. Yeah, I think I do. Okay, off you go. All right, let me see how her rump is. Oh, she's pretty good. Let me see if there's anything else I need to pull off this car. Nope, she looks pretty good. All right. Yes, Gannon. You're going to sniff everything. Okay. All right. Let me, let me get on the other side so I can her back her up. Before you take her out, I think we'll change her bell. They're usually pretty docile when they're on their backs. <laughs> Thank goodness. Okay. Let me get the worm stuff. Eric, I'll get into the position. You can see me doing the learning. See, I have to give a, I give about for 500 pounds, actually, not 500, 250. I think she's that much? Well, you overdose. Mm -hmm. Okay, you got it. Go. Okay, come on. <coughs> come on, Mama. All right. Turn around. Flip around. Okay. You're in, girl. You got a dinger in yours? No, oh, she's got a dinger missing, too. No. Well, she I just has a wire. She just has a wire. She's making a... noise. Oh, I have others with dingers. We yeah. don't have her perfect. Okay, your number, what are you, number, number 20. Oh, this is Nola Chucky, the famous Nola Chucky. I don't want to chew it. Ah! <laughs> All right, he didn't get it, totally. Watch out for the legs, the legs, the legs. He's having a little fit, a slight spaz. Just get a grip, Nola Chucky. do we trim hooves now? We trim hooves twice a year. We used to do it in the winter, but we found that they didn't really need it. So we actually, they only, we even cut back on their worming. We used to worm four times a year, but now 
we only worm now before they get bred, before we put the ram in, and then we worm them at the time they give birth, and then right before they go out on the pasture. You say this is Nola Chucky? Nola Chucky. <coughs> this is the one that had two lambs, and then six days later had two more last year. We have bells on them just because we like the sound of it, but also it supposedly discourages coyotes because they get freaked out by the sound of the bells. Okay, now she's going to be, I think, one of my larger coats. Uh, this is a little larger. Really? Well, we can check her when she gets off. You, want to you got her? Okay, you got her? Yep. All right. Let's see if it comes down too far. I think that's probably okay. Yeah, right. When the llama sits like that, this is called cushing. Hello. You don't refer to cushing in a sheep, but you do to a llama. Oh, nice. This might be Prada. She's a good mother, too. Recognize the name, Eric? Prada? No. Julie Kempton gave us these names. Prada, Dolce, can't remember the other one. They're all advertisers in the New Yorker. For expensive clothing. <laughs> it's good for me to hold on to the you while he's working on the feet because uh, it, they get a little freaked out easily and this sort of calms them down. Some it doesn't help at all, but most of it does. Notice the curiosity of she, the ones that are next. Yeah, she's giving her the smell. She may be the next candidate, you know. That could be Weaverly. In fact, that looks like Weaverly. It's got her fleece. That is Weaverly. Weaverly is the one that was a triplet that we had the bottle feed. So she's a little friendlier. But for sheep, it's better to give them a loose salt rather than a big block of salt, although we have used the salt licks from time to time, which they love. It's got a lot of molasses in it. Yes, you're being very good. I think you are Prada. You were a good mother, too. Yeah. Alright, hang on to her. I gotta change her uh, bell. <coughs> there, I got it. Oh, we're getting done. <coughs> oh, it's alright. We're almost through. <laughs> Okay, Mama. <clears throat> All right. I'll go just to to this one.